Hey there everybody, it is The Last Raider. I am back, second video today. I, I don't know if I can keep this up forever. I know I can keep up at least one video a day now. But I'm getting to where I can put two up a day. Uh, I've been able to find openings in my schedule at least. And uh, trying to keep things backlogged. But right now, today, on a Saturday, mind you, uh, we have seen the SJWs, probably in Marvel, DC... Those people who like to come out, be woke, and tell everyone, tell you all that you that your crap, your content, the booty that you like to see in there, the the chicks that look like chicks, the men that look like men, that all that's problematic, and no, and you're in the minority in the wrong side of history. Uh, we see them coming out and pretty much admitting to the entire world that uh, they're full of dog crap. So anyway. Right here we have that umbrella guy, and if y'all y'all don't know, that umbrella guy has his second uh, littlest umbrella book that's come out. I did not get a chance to get the first one. I'm gonna see if there is a chance to get both of them because I like the concept of it. And uh, basically tonight he's been trying to get it out there. I think he's been with Peter Sametti trying to do a live launch of the book and uh you can see right here in this tweet flagged again fourth four times in less than a day to keep us from marketing our comic books it's insane i'll go live in a second with peter Sametti, and uh you, he's got the project down there which by the way um tug i'm i'll put a link to uh tug's thing in the description to his indiegogo and i might even do a promotional video on it because uh hey might as well but let's just be frank, folks. This is uh, this is the the admission by all these morons, all these weirdos. They they want to come out and they want to tell you that oh, you know your stuff, your stuff is bad. Nobody wants your stuff because it's problematic. But then they're coming in here trying to underhandedly take out their competition because in reality, they know their competition. They know that their product is shit. They know their product can't compete. They know that in a fair match, and I've said this many a times, if Comicsgate ever gets on the shelf, if they were to ever get onto the shelf of a comic book stand, it would beat the living crap out of the big two in sales in a matter of minutes. You would not be able to put, you would have comic shops call, coming forward saying, hey, uh, can we get another Cyberfrog? Can, 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 can we get another Jawbreakers? Can we can we get another kill all men? I think they do that already. <laughs> but it's like, can, can we get another um, lug? Can we get all this? Can we get these other things? Can we get uh, blue mamba? Can we get more of all these? Can we get more of the expendables go to hell because they are flying off the shelves and we can't keep them up there? Well, we have Marvel to sell. Yeah, y'all know that shit don't sell, and uh, they understand this. They know. And this, in my opinion, uh, my, my message to Tug out there, keep on trucking, dude. This is the admission of this is the admission of their lie, all right? Their lie is that nobody wants what we have to put out there. Nobody wants what el everybody else wants, okay? We want good stories, good art, good content. And they know that all they're doing is they're just pushing propaganda that's just cut it out, paste it onto a new character saying it and then go on with the nonsense same thing if you if you picked up a any other marvel book you now know what every other marvel book is saying it's the same crap it's the same bull crap and the stories aren't even that well written i mean it sucks they're not even that well written but hey tug guess what they're admitting that you're gonna kill it i predict that probably tug is gonna easily beat his original you're gonna. I, I here's here's what I'm gonna say because of this. Tug is gonna easily beat the numbers that he did before. He's gonna surpass his sales that he did last time easily. How far will he go? I don't know. Okay, sky's the limit at this point. But I mean, these idiots want to instigate the Streisand effect. Go right ahead. Uh, like one YouTuber said, if y'all would stop doing stupid shit. I wouldn't stop making videos about it, okay? <laughs> That's just how this is. But hey, Tug, monetize the haters, talk bad about them in chat, 
uh, talk to him about it, make some jokes about him. You and Peter Smitty have some fun with it tonight. Uh, this just proves to me you're going to kill it. As usual, folks, I'm The Last Raider. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Hit that notification bell so you know when I'm going to have a video up because I'm putting them out just about every day and I've got content so I know some people are probably going to want to see. As usual, stay safe, stay frosty, and I'll see you guys in the next video.